goat with 1.7 million Facebook followers. Gary the goat and his lewd, crude best mate Jimbo are breathing new life into otherwise quiet country towns. All right, Gary, big gig tonight, mate, in these pub. Gary's the kind of goat that rides in the truck, never on the back. Hello, Gary. He's not livestock, he's a lifestyle. Yeah, mate. Jimbo just said making look good and the girls pulled out all the stock. Yeah, so we got the glitter out. Six years ago, nomadic comedian Jimbo Bazubi bought Gary for a carton of beer in Western Australia. I just thought, OK, I'll try it. Threw him in the car and I thought I'd just have him for a day or two. I was going to, and, but he didn't f sort of in the car. And I thought, oh, that's a good thing. And then one time I was walking down the shops and I just thought, oh, I'll let you go, you know. Like, this is not a hostage situation. And um, he started following me. And I had him for a good couple of years and some guy came up to me and said, oh, why don't you have a Facebook page? Gary, I'd watch that. These days, Gary has more followers than any goat on social media. He's got more fans than Marnie the dog and Maru the cat. But he has a long way to go before reaching the heights of Grumpy Cat or Boo. I think I'll try the uh, Roby's class first. That's it, mate. No need to scream. How would you feel if people scream when they saw you walk into the gym? When they saw the video, they go, I go just don't do that, mate. Gary first caught the attention of the police and subsequently the media a few years back. A magistrate dismisses a case against Gary the Goat for eating flowers at a museum garden. Gary the Goat's taught the Rocks cops a valuable lesson today and that's don't bite off more than you can chew. Since then, Jimbo keeps Gary away from the capital cities. He brings his unconventional mate along to his comedy gigs all over the country, from Roebuck Plains to Iron Knob, Timber Creek, and plenty more out of the way towns. Not in a circular manner, probably 15 laps of Australia, kilometre wise, and we just literally drive. We've got this thing at night where he goes bar, I go Gary, and he goes bar, so I know where they are, you know? I love like going to places I've never heard of before. Like, we're in Neath. Who's heard of that? I meet people and I stay at their places, and he doesn't get mobbed out here, but it's just a, a nostalgic part of Australia which still exists. The Neath pub is almost bigger than Neath itself, which at last count had a population of 432. Newcastle's that way, Cessnock's that way, Maitland's over there. It's just the kind of place Jimbo and Gary love, and the locals love them back. Gary's got pretty big on the internet, you know, see Gary down here? You know Gary does f all, don't you? This is the, the first time I've ever remember Neath having something like this. Is it a fairly unique experience? I think it's just really cool that they're kind of like bringing awareness to some cool little places in Australia. Well, you reckon next election, if we can get him enrolled, Malcolm Turnbull, Short and Gary the Goat, eh? He's going to eat through red and green tape. Yeah, I think it's brilliant. It's what country towns need, you know. Everyone needs to have a laugh. Just a goat and a bloke going around. <laughs> you can't get much better than that. I wouldn't say I'm keeping Neath alive, but I definitely like to think I am keeping a few pubs alive. A lot of these small towns, once they lose a pub, that's the end of the town. So they're helping me and I'm helping them, really. Thank you, Neath, and good night. show on Gary the Goat tonight, I thought it was that goat that, you know, we often play in packages, that goes, oh, that's the screaming goat. That's not the screaming goat, that's Gary the Goat. No, that goat's not Mozzie. Gary's no, Aussie. No, he doesn't have 1.7 million followers. Oh, uh, G Gary's obviously got great Aussie values. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to help out, Jimbo and Gary, they still have heaps of gigs to go in their current tour of New South Wales and Queensland. Go along, check them out. They're worth it. Uh, by we should point out, if you check them out, probably best the kids don't watch, just to be clear. We don't want any accidents at home. Uh, we're going to go to a break. How about the website? GaryTheGoat.tv. That's where you get your tickets. Oh, not a bad story, hey, Gary? No, you give a fuck.